G'day, Keithy here. Thanks for joining me. So today's video is something a little bit different, but it's still got to do with four-wheel driving and the channel itself. Today's video is a blooper reel, so it's going to be a bit of the outtakes and things that haven't quite gone right when I've been making these videos for you. Even as a small YouTube channel, there are still things that can go wrong and there's a lot of time that it takes to make these videos. For example, this video has already taken about three and a half hours to gather all the footage and edit for you. But otherwise, sit back and enjoy the bloopers. See you next time. Sensors, I've extended them by 48 mils, 48 millimeters extra length to the rear height sensor. And I was just hoping to use the Waybridge, mate. Oh, no problems. Yeah, I just tried to call up before, but I couldn't get a hold of you. Epic adventure, P38 land. So I've got the big rig out here, and what happened is... Oh, stop, stop, stop. Let's go and have a look. Keithy here, thanks for joining me again. Say something. Good morning. Oh, come on. We'll go for a walk and have a look and see who's here and... We're videoing strange people doing strange things, yeah. which I know of. Nothing. Oh. Not much, mate. I tried to answer your call, but it wouldn't let me for some reason. Oh, really? Yeah. I was probably because of the a bit yeah. ordinary out here. New cars? This is a lot of people, eh? Man. I can hear gunshots, but I don't know where they're coming from. I don't know if someone's shooting a cow or a horse. Plus, we're on the farm and it's really cool. I am so excited. It's a dream come true. Strange looking muddy thing there, but who really cares? It's really cool. This is the best experience ever. Well, besides going to America, anyway. <laughs> Strange people. Hey, Joel's already in there, isn't he? I think we have a winner. Yeah, Joel's in there. Yeah. It looks like we have a stucco. Ah, uh, you gotta go forward out. You can't go backwards because there's a big step there. Because I made it. <laughs> <laughs> Him stuck. Oh, dude, look at his car. He was recently bogged. Now, he is. Dun, dun, dun. And then see the little blue bob there with the hat on? That's Keith. He's trying to help him. Dun, dun, dun. Then there are cute two little dogs with a baby and a dad who has a seriously large, uh, what do you call them, camera. And then he is winching them up. See? So smart, eh? Bye. So we've just done the highway run. Um, boy, why you play game? Why you play game? No.
done them um, and I've got the numbers. So what I've got to do now, if this bug wouldn't bugger off, is I've got to go and start this bloody video again because that was well interrupted by that man in life. In that respect, that I'd like to find something that will do the job. Oh, there's a fire hell, the police are here too. I'd best pull up. Okay. There's a car here that looks like it's rolled over. So I just, um, I just had a chat to a cyclist who was riding down Mount Stewart just now. Here comes another cop car, funny enough. I'll just pull up the talking for a second while the cop car goes past. Where are we? Holy moly. So anyway, this cyclist, um, he's the one that called the police just now, funny enough. He said he was coming down on his bush bike and this... Uh, it looked like a Nissan Pathfinder type four wheel drive, a reasonably new one. And he was going up Mount Stewart just now. Had a bloody rate of knots, probably about 80 k's an hour by the sounds. And his car rolled end for end twice and landed where I just went past them. Holy moly. He said it was good. The police rocked up less than six minutes after he called them, which is really good for out here. Like Mount Stewart is. It's not in town, you've got a fair decent drive to get there. Uh, and what I saw then, there were two tow trucks, there were two cop cars, the fireys, and, and an ambulance as well. Like, that was, that's a really good response in six minutes. But it's just crazy to think that that some people drive like this. Like, Mount Stewart is your typical mountain drive, it's, it's windy. The speed limit's 40 k's an hour. Uh, and old mate on the, on the push bike reckons he was doing about 60 or more, uh, sorry, 80 or more and what's happened is he's just he hasn't been able to turn the car for the corner drive safe people that's a Nissan Pathfinder or thereabouts you know an SUV type car it's not a sports car you got to drive accordingly and that's a classic example of someone driving like a dickhead righto onwards we go alrighty I'm on my way back Driver. So if you've got one of these bad boys and you want to lift it up using the spaces as per, I think it's that video right there. Let's just stop that and not do that one again. The camera's moving.
It's moving! Don't move! All good. I'll wait for those gunshots to stop. And okay. G'day. No. It lives in the deep depths of the Range Rover Valley. It lives.